Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So what I did, I did a little something different. I kept Googling how to make your lips bigger, how to make your lips bigger for the past couple months. And then I made my own technique on how I like to do it. So I just hope that this helps you guys and it's a very natural and simple way to do it. Also, don't forget the back to school giveaway in July 31st. You have to be subscribed to my channel and Gossip Tossup's channel as well as comment hashtag back to school. If you try this look, please do hashtag Angie Ray on your Instagram or Twitter or whatever. And I would love to see if you guys have tried this. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Bye. All right, it's really simple how to achieve big lips without having to scrub your lips with anything or without having to suck on something because if you do something like that let me tell you something those your lips will not last all day long if you're scrubbing your lips if you're sucking onto something or anything like that your lips stay on for approximately probably about three to four hours and that's all you have left so what you want to do is you want to do something that helps your lips pretty me all night at the club or all night and day your key to doing that is going to be lip liner and not just any kind of lip liner what you want to do is you want to get lip liner that matches the almost the exact same color as your lips so that it looks very kind of natural and it doesn't look you know it doesn't look too fake okay so mine is going to be in the L'Oreal Paris and it is going to be in the color All Natural. It looks like this right here. So what you want to do is first of all, overdraw your lips. So go ahead and put your lips like this and you're just going to overdraw the lining of your lips and then you're going to overdraw the bottoms of your lips. So let's do this. As you can see, mine is pretty much close to the same color as my lips. So let's go overdraw them. And you can kind of overdraw with a heavy hand if you want to. And I kind of do this just to kind of fade out the harshness on the bottom. As you see, they already look a little bigger. Now what you want to do is fill them in halfway. As you can see, this part is not colored in, or neither is this part right here. What you want to do is take a light pink. Well, because I'm going to be putting on a simple pink gloss. So what I want to do is I want to accentuate and highlight this part of my lip. Just so that it looks like my lips are naturally puckered out. And if you have a little mistake like this, go ahead and just wipe it off. So yeah, taking this color is L'Oreal Paris Rich um, Lip Liners as well. It's in the color All About Pink, and it looks like this right here. So go ahead and just hit the center. As you can see, my lips already look bigger, and I can promise you, I'm not puckering my lips at all. It honestly just takes a natural lip liner, and that's it. So even if you want your lips to be super big, I mean, easily overdraw them again. This is probably the most I would overdraw my lips though. You can even overdraw the bottom lip if you want to make your bottom look bigger. But the fact that my bottom lip is way bigger, I think, than my top lip is fine. So then you're going to want to take your gloss. I'm going to take a nice pinky gloss from uh, Maybelline New York. It's in the color 505, as you can see. And this gloss is perfect because it has kind of like a little guide right here. So I'm really going to hit the center. And this, see, like I said, this is perfect because then you can go over it. Mm -hmm. 
and it's naturally bigger. And I'm talking like two sizes bigger. If you want to accentuate a little more to give a little highlight right here, I'm just gonna take my Elf Peach Please in that champagne color, and I'm really just gonna hit the center. And it'll give me just a little glow. These are what the lips look like. I'm not puckering them up at all from both sides. And this will last you all day, you guys. You don't have to suck on any cups or scrubs or anything like that. This is a super natural way to do it. And if it does run out, I mean, it'll run out probably after six or eight hours. And all you have to do is put on some more gloss. Or if you did it matte, all you'd have to do is fill in your lips a little bit. But most definitely, if you do keep your lips matte, I have kept my lips matte with the Kaylin, um matte tint and i kept my on there my whole shift at work which is eight hours well nine hours including my break and i didn't have to put anything on so you keep it matte it will stay a longer time than if you want to put gloss and if you see your gloss is going down just add a little bit more gloss and you're fine unlike if you were to scrub your lips they'll look big for a little bit and then they will look small after that and then there's no way of fixing it unless you're at work and you want to just scrub on your lips so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it, especially if you guys try this. Just do the hashtag Angie Ray, and I would love to see your lips after you've done it like this. And let me know what you guys think about this, and comment down below if you guys want to see anything different or anything else from me. Um, yeah, and just please don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget about the back to school giveaway. Um, it's going to end July 31st, so I hope you guys enter to it, and that's it. Have a great day, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.